The world's biggest gambling hub wants answers. Senior Macau casino and junket executives met with authorities on Monday and demanded details on a proposed regulatory crackdown. The meeting, shown online, highlighted uncertainty hanging over the industry. Macau's government kicked off a regulatory overhaul on September the 14th, sending shares in casinos plunging, especially as the city's lucrative casino licenses are up for rebidding next year. The meeting was the only official opportunity for the industry to air its views during a 45-day gaming consultation. Macau authorities have identified nine areas of potential change. They include having government representatives supervise daily casino operations, as well as overseeing the number of licenses and employee welfare. Industry executives have agreed that Macau's 20-year gaming law needs to be updated. Casino firm Galaxy told the meeting the company wanted more information on several areas, including the introduction of government representatives and clarifications on potential responsibilities and penalties for criminal acts. Junket operators, middlemen who bring in wealthy Chinese gamblers to Macau, were more vocal. They want details on amendments to criminalise accepting cash deposits, currently a common practice. Authorities are due to hold four more consultations, all with the public, in October.